Now a little bit of how the sausage is made, but if you can't tell, kind of a space nerd. Let's see how the class went. C165, Integrated Physical Sciences. Now, if you can't tell by the intro, this is the first course that I saw in my degree plan that I was actually excited to take. Now, there's been a couple of courses that I've taken that haven't been too bad and that I've kind of enjoyed, but I love science. Like, I love anything that has to do with space travel or, you know, the galaxies or just the universe in general. Like, that stuff has just always been really interesting to me. Now, this course is broken down into four main units. Uh, it's the nature of science, physics, chemistry, and earth science. Earth science is going to be your biggest section of it. I think it contributed to like 40% of the OA. Um, but the earth science has a lot of uh, space stuff. It's probably broken down into like two sections. Earth science is like half like the science of the earth, obviously. But the other half is uh, like our solar system and our galaxy and things like that. You know, it's more, it's half space, half earth. Uh, but physics and chemistry probably make up the other... I don't know, 30%, and then the nature of science is just like maybe, it's more like you're uh, explaining what controlled experiments are and hypothesis, and you know, it's like, this whole course actually was really a lot of like seventh grade math, it felt like, like it, it felt like this course probably could have just been a whole entire list of Bill Nye videos, and that would get you through. Now, par for the course, I didn't touch the reading material at all. If you go into the course search, there's probably 20 to 25, uh, five to 10 minute videos that tell you everything you need to know about this course. Uh, and they're all pretty good, they're engaging, they're not that boring. I mean, I'm interested in this kind of stuff, so it wasn't boring to me, but some people might hate it. But anyway, if you go in there and just watch all of them on two times speed, you can get through them in a few hours. And uh, so I watched those, I took the PA, I didn't get exemplary, but I passed everything. Um, I spent probably like two or three more hours like going over the things that I didn't get that you know, good the first time. Uh, scheduled the OA and passed it. Uh, this is definitely an accelerator course. Uh, you can get by with just those videos, and I think you'll be just fine. Uh, if you absolutely have to, you can dive into the reading material, but I have no opinion about how that book is because I didn't touch it. But, uh, yeah, I think this, uh, what everyone says about this course, this being a quick, easy one, I completely agree. Um, it's an interesting course. All the videos were pretty good. Um, they have them, so if you actually, like, open up, like, the Nature of Science section, it'll have like say five videos or six videos on that, but there's actually only three videos. For some reason they post the video and then they post a video of the transcript of that video. I don't really understand why they did that, but they did. So if you open up one of the sections and you're like, oh my God, there's 10 videos. No, there's really only five videos and five transcript videos of the original videos. So I, I don't know why they did it like that. Now a couple key things I would make sure that you study. Um, make sure you understand the plate shifts and the plate movements and what that does as far as like volcanoes or earthquakes and things like that. They're pretty big on that on the OA. Uh, the behavior of matter and structure of matter. Like make sure you understand your atoms and compounds and ions and things like that. You know, electrons, protons, neutrons and what they do and what kind of charge they have. Um, they go over a little bit of periodic table on here, but it's not too bad. And they have a pretty good little section uh, to break down the periodic table. Um, the properties of waves, your motion and force, um, they go over that a good bit. But I mean, yeah, I'm, I might be spouting off a lot of things, but if you go and jump into those videos, they break them down all pretty easy. Like, it's all pretty easy to understand, you know. It's, it may sound like a lot, but once you get into it and watch it, you know, there's really not a whole lot. If you don't already know it, it's, it's like I said, it's kind of like a refresher of seventh grade. Uh, yeah, or just go watch Bill Nye videos. That is all I really have. Uh, like I said, it's a pretty fast, easy course that you can knock out in a couple days if you really want to, or if somebody who hates science, you know, I can't imagine it taking anybody more than a week. Uh, so just, yeah, we'll just go watch those videos and take the PA, then study what you don't do well on. You should be just fine. Now, we just hit 400 subscribers, so that's awesome, guys. Uh, I appreciate everybody supporting the channel. It's really cool, man. Uh, but anyway, yeah, that's all I have. So uh, jumping into next, um, actually, I don't know what I'm jumping into next. Uh, I have AT for the military coming up in like seven days. So uh, I don't, I'm undecided between concepts and marketing and compensation and benefits. So I guess if anybody's done either of those course courses uh, in the comments, let me know which one's faster, uh, which one, whichever one I can knock out in about seven days. 
But uh, yeah, that's it. Uh, again, I really appreciate everybody subscribing me since day one. Yeah, hopefully the videos have gotten a little bit better since then, but who knows? It's still me doing them, so. But that's all I have. I'll see you guys in the next one.